Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel T-Spot. In this video, what is the common feature between Walter White, Michael Scott, Laura Lee Gilmore, Tony Soprano, and Dana Reese Targaryen? They were not in the same TV show, they don't come from similar backgrounds, their personalities differ tremendously, and they have completely different story arcs that take place in different universes. But there is one thing common between all of them they are all iconic TV show characters who are timeless and perhaps even more famous than their respective TV shows. This is very important in having a successful series that captivates the masses. If your characters are bland and none of them stands out as unique and unforgettable to the audience, then there is no point in having the best scenario, best cinematography, or even the best cast members. Even a single iconic character can carry a show upon his or her shoulders. Yellowstone is one of those blessed shows that have not only the best of everything, but also the best characters who are already living legends in the fans' minds, especially the patriarch of the family. John Dutton is the peak of masculinity and manhood that everyone either wants to be or wants to be with. Thus, we feel like his imminent death in the upcoming season 5, part 2 will have detrimental effects on the show. However, the way he dies can change everything, not only for the future of the series but also for the legacy of the character. First, we have to analyze why are we all obsessed with John Dutton. The initial thing that comes to mind is the fact that as the patriarch of the Dutton family and the owner of the Yellowstone Ranch, he holds considerable power and influence in the region. And, with great power comes great charisma that can influence millions. He is known for his unwavering determination and resilience in protecting his land and family legacy. He is willing to do whatever it takes to maintain control and preserve the ranch. If there is any personality trait that everyone loves and appreciates, it is determination and consistency, regardless of his or her beliefs. Also, John Dutton has a deep love for his country and a strong attachment to traditional values. He believes in the importance of family loyalty and preserving the way of life associated with ranching. These values are respected by the majority of society and even the ones who oppose them can appreciate the way someone stands for his or her values. Besides, John Dutton is a complex character with both admirable qualities and flaws. He could be ruthless and manipulative when necessary, sometimes resorting to morally questionable methods to achieve his goals. In a way, he is a morally gray character that we find difficult to understand. Sometimes, he is like a puzzle that we are constantly trying to solve and yet fail at all times. This complexity makes him even more attractive as we cannot take our eyes off of him, wondering what he will do next. We also have to mention that as a father and a rancher, John Dutton is fiercely protective of his family and his land. He is willing to confront any threats, whether they come from rival ranchers, developers or even within his own family. We don't claim that he is an exemplary father by any means, but we see him as the father who does his best even though his best might not be ideal at all times. He loves his family in his way, and we believe this is more than many people do. John Dutton tends to keep his emotions and thoughts guarded. He often presents a stoic and reserved demeanor, making it challenging for others to understand his true intentions and feelings. This reserved nature is make him seem not only cooler, but also more mysterious, adding to his complex character. Also, his constant poker face makes him a very good businessman who never plays his card. Open with years of experience running the ranch, John Dutton possesses a wealth of knowledge and wisdom about the land, a cattle business, and the complexities of the region. He draws upon this experience to navigate the challenges he faces. He also values the traditional experience his family carries for decades, if not centuries, which makes him even wiser than he already is. Now, all these prove that he has an irreplaceable role in the Yellowstone universe, making it a lot more difficult to say goodbye to him. But we truly believe that if he gets a proper ending, he might die as a legend and have an unforgettable legacy at the end. Even Kevin Costner, the actor who plays the part on the show, feels the same. We know that he made it clear he would not show up on the show if he would not like the ending of his character. He openly expressed that he doesn't want John Dutton to die in a car crash or other cheesy plot elements like that. We also know that Taylor Sheridan wouldn't want the character of John Dutton to die off screen, knowing that the fans would go mad in such a scenario. This means that the car crash and any off screen death are off the table. In our opinion, this leaves us with two options. 
Either John will die because of an illness or he will be killed by one of his loved ones. Illness option is out of nowhere and would not fit into his legendary status. However, being killed by a loved one would add a Shakespearean value to the show and bring the character's story to the full circle. Being killed by the one you wanted to protect the most your family. In that case, many people assume that Jamie would be the one to kill him. However, we believe that this would be too expected and Jamie has already killed a father. Now it is time for Beth to shine. Why would Beth kill his father though? Though we know that Beth got shocked over the fact that John was keeping the train station a secret. From Beth while Jamie was informed of all the secrets of the family. In our opinion, she is not the one to let such a scandal slide. Not that she would choose Jamie over his father, but it is certain that she will hold John accountable for what he has done. In the end, she will go too far to the point of mistakenly killing his father, one man who she valued more than anyone else. This will be the tragic and epic ending that we all have been asking for. And this will make John Dutton the legend he already is. What are your thoughts on John Dutton's death? How will he die in your opinion? Let us know what you think in the comments below. And don't forget to like, subscribe and share the video. Thank you for watching. See you soon.